I'm going to use Minitab Express to find the probability that x is less than 107 when x is normally distributed with a mean of 100 and standard deviation of 15. Since this is not standard normal, I could certainly do this by hand using the standard normal table, first converting x to a z-score where I would subtract 100 from 107 and then divide that difference by 15. But it is a little quicker to use technology. In Minitab Express, you want to select the Statistics tab. And there's two ways to do this. Because we're finding an area that's to the left of x, we can use the CDF option, the Cumulative Distribution function. And we want our form of input to be a single x value. So I'm going to enter in 107. And here is where we can change the parameters. The mean is no longer 0 and 1 for the standard normal case. The mean is now 100 and the standard deviation is 15. Click on OK. And let me close out my spreadsheet. You'll see that the corresponding probability rounded to two decimal places is 0.68. The other way to do this, which gives a corresponding graph, is to go back to the Statistics tab, select Distribution Plot, scroll to Display Probability. We want a normal distribution, but again, we're changing our mean and standard deviation so we don't have to convert x to a z-score. And we're um, going to give it a specified x value. And because we are looking for an area to the left of 107, I want this left tail option and input the X value and click on OK. So you'll see the corresponding graph. It's shading to the left of 107. And this value here is the area to the left of 107 under the bell curve. It's also the corresponding probability of randomly selecting an x value that is less than 107.